Hello everybody, Shazoo is here. I'm out here in the Mad Science Laboratory. Uh, Going to do a little demonstration about off the grid type power using Tesla technology. So, bear with me here and I'll uh, get it all together. Okay, it's uh, the real Shazay's here. Uh, it's blatantly obvious that guy wasn't me. He's a little better looking. And uh, so what we got going on here is uh, I got a uh, little mini Tesla coil that here that I'm going to use as a uh, antenna. We're going to use these coils around to uh, basically energize this antenna right here. I'll have to explain this particular coil in a in a different video. But uh, for the meantime, I'm just going to use it for this little experiment here to uh, basically give you some sort of idea of what off the grid uh, wireless energy using Tesla coils would be. Uh, let me kill that light over there. Do, 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 do. Okay. Everything seems to look better closer up whenever that light ain't flashing in there. Okay, what we got here. In case you can't read it very good, uh, it says Shaziz's dump on the front. All right, it's made out of some ice cream sticks, and it has a little uh, LED nightlight bulb in there in the socket with some wires hanging out the top over here. <laughs> All right, first we're going to need some earth, so we got a got some earth there. <laughs> And we got Shaziz's dump. Of course, we're going to need somebody to be uh, living at Shaziz's dump. So we got my new lab assistant right here. He, uh, it's a right uh, handsome young man. <laughs> so we got to figure out a name for him. Anyway, what we're going to do here is uh, there's two wires coming off that little socket for the mini light bulb. We're going to connect which would be the secondary off of this little mini Tesla coil because we're not going to be uh, trying to generate uh, power from the source here using the primary. What we're going to do with this experiment is just use that little mini Tesla coil as the antenna and this will be my ground wire right here. Alright and so I got me a ground wire over here that I'll run across and we'll hook this up here and uh, I think we're all set this one off the primary this one off the ground that goes out to the earth to a three uh, foot rebar I put a short rebar in there because I didn't want a real heavy duty ground for my system I think I've explained that in a few other videos but Maybe later I'll do another video and explain it again. Show you the reason why. <clears throat> anyway, here we go. All we got to do now is flip this switch right here. And that little light bulb should come on. And uh, our little fellow here, uh, the little troll, I hope he's going to share that apple with me because I'm getting kind of hungry. <laughs> All right, here we go. Flip the switch. The light should come on. Yay! We have wireless energy being transmitted from the large Tesla coil in the back and there's a Tesla coil right over here on the side. If you can do trying to point at it. There it is. Ah. Ah. Anyway, so our little troll buddy now has a uh, light. Let's uh, kill some more lights here. It's night time. He's wasting burning free energy. What kind of, kind of individual is that? There you go. So now Shaziz's dump is illuminated. All right, no power. Beep. If you notice that uh, little LED takes a little while to drain down, and uh, that's because inside those little uh, mini LED uh, nightlight bulbs, they, I think I got them at the Everything a Dollar store, but uh, there's little uh, miniature uh, circuits in there with capacitors, and it stores a bit of a charge there, <coughs> and so. Whenever you turn it off, it doesn't die immediately. It just kind of dims out. 
see that dimming out? Okay. Anyway, uh, let me uh, unplug our ground here. Okay, you notice the light's still on and we're not grounded. So we got energy coming off of the Tesla coil there. Wireless energy, but the reason why it's not uh, as bright is because like Nikola Tesla was trying to tell everybody about baiting electrons out of the ground. That's how you get those Tesla coils to be able to put it, produce a whole lot more energy. See, if I reach over and grab a hold of this, I become the ground. You notice it started uh, brightening up before I actually got the chance to touch it. But uh, there you go. There's the ground wire right there. And so essentially, Shiziz's dump is now off the grid using wireless energy. So uh, let me hook my earth ground back to this thing right here so I've got to keep holding out there. There we go, we're back on the earth ground. And kill the power from the uh, Tesla coils and poink! There you go. Now, you can see that there's energy coming to the house. So if while that uh, big Tesla coil is up and a running, wherever, like maybe you got a farm and you got one of the, the uh, huge ones that you're using for a power source to power up uh, your barns and all that kind of stuff. Well, while it's up and running, you can be charging uh, battery packs in your uh, in your dump here, like mine, my Shiziz's dump. And then that way when the power goes down, you'll still have lights. So, there it is. That's a little mini off the grid. Uh, just a basic example of how, how uh, wireless energy transfer uh, of uh, Nikola Tesla's uh, design, the uh, Tesla coil. And we got, like I said, a little mini Tesla coil over there. Let me turn uh, the light back on. You can see that again. There we go. Okay, everybody say goodbye to, uh, shoot, I'm blinding him. Ah. Yeah, now you can't even see him at all. Everybody say goodbye to my new lab assistant. He's got a uh, nice uh, lab hair. Uh, kind of like me once in a while. <laughs> there you go. If you have any questions, feel free to give me a holler and uh, we'll uh, work whatever we need to out. And uh, th that's it, man. Shiziz's dump is off the grid. Boing. <laughs> Peace and love, everybody.